So on yesterday, Sunday, January 30th, Bishop Noel Jones, who is now 72 years old, proposed to his girlfriend of 28 years with a ring from a Cracker Jack box. Now, there's a lot wrong with the sentence I just said, but none of it is allegedly or inaccurate or anything like that. Bishop Noel Jones just turned 72 years old and he's been dating his girlfriend Loretta on and off for 28 years. And they both appeared on the reality show Preachers of L.A. about seven years ago. And their relationship was very controversial because of the fact that Loretta wanted to get married and it seemed like Bishop Noel Jones was just stringing her along. And for a man that preaches the word of God to people to string a woman along like that just seemed wrong on so many levels. But now at 72, Bishop Noel Jones has decided to marry Loretta so that he does not have to grow old alone. He literally says in his proposal that you're about to watch that he's going to need someone to push his wheelchair soon. And he also talks about all the freedom he's given up by marrying her. It really was a sad proposal if y'all ask me. I try to keep my opinion to a minimum in these videos, but I have to tell you guys, this was a really sad proposal if you ask me. And y'all can watch and tell me what y'all think in the comments. But if you listen closely to the words coming out of his mouth, they actually sound insulting. And he literally pulls a ring out of a Cracker Jack box. I couldn't make this up if I tried. Y'all take a look. He said, no, you're going to wait a while until somebody's going to have to deal with you broken down. <laughs> because they won't be able to say, I can put up with him drooling. I can put up with him needing the wheelchair pushed. I can put up with him falling out of bed because it wasn't always that way. But he said, Reverend, you will wait until it's only that way. <laughs> so I decided that I'm gonna get married. And it, when it was rumored some time ago that I was getting married, I remember saying to you that I've been with you for 20 something years then, not 28 like it is now, but it was about 24, no, it was about, uh, yeah, it don't matter. But I told you that I wouldn't, we held hands every Sunday, we related to each other every Sunday, and I told you that I would not sneak off somewhere and get mad and let you find out on the side. So I'm telling you today, security, I'm telling you today that I'm going to get mad. Loretta, come up here, please. Now, now, I thought about, should I, 
I thought about should I? Give up my freedom coat for a straight jacket. I thought about should I, at my age, get married to someone way younger than me. I thought about should I give up not having to answer to anybody if I'm in Africa and I wanted to go to Europe if I wanted to leave Europe and go to Asia to Japan I wouldn't have to call anybody I talk about should I have somebody censoring who comes to my house She sure can't come. I'm talking about should I have to give up my Ferrari, buy a station wagon, and then when I looked at her, I said, "Well." Should you have to push a wheelchair when I can't walk? <laughs> Don't go so fast. Slow down. Should you have to deal with an old man when you could have have many suitors who are so young? Should you have to be listening to a man who's intoxicated with the exuberance of his own verbosity? And should you have to deal with somebody who is set in his ways? After I thought about all the shoulds, I decided that if I keep on thinking about should. Then I won't get this thing done. So I need you to give me some help here. I gotta pull something out of the. I gotta give me a cracker jack ring up. I got away from all the shoulds. Should I? Should you? And I've decided simply to say, Will you? Marry me. I'm getting married. What did you say? I said yes. Congratulations, Bishop. And, and Sister Loretta, amen. Come on, see the refuge. Put if I was Loretta, I could not have accepted a ring presented to me in that way. Not out of a Cracker Jack box because this is not a time for jokes, and I would not agree to a marriage with an older man who specifically told me he wants me to be his nurse in his old age. It would be different if he was older than me, but he wasn't telling me he specifically wanted me to nurse him, but he's literally saying that he wants someone to push his wheelchair. And so waiting over 20 years, if you actually wanna get married, 
is really sad to me. This is just my opinion. I cannot celebrate this. I would not advise anyone to model their relationship after this. And I'm disappointed to see this behavior. That's just me. But y'all leave a comment and let me know what y'all think. As always, thanks for watching. Layla, 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 tell us it all.